So last night, I came across the greatest thing to ever grace this planet on the internet. It's called Provo's Most Eligible, the Mormon Bachelor of BYU. <laughs> These like 19-year-old kids at BYU have made their own show. I sat my ass down for 45 minutes to watch the first episode, and it's incredible. <laughs> Now you're thinking, okay, they probably don't have their own Chris Harrison, right? They don't have their own Chris Harrison, but they have their own Remington. But do they have limos for the girls to get out of? No, but they have a van the girls get out of. How about a mansion? Do they have a mansion? No, they don't have a mansion. But they do have, like, their bishop's house with pictures of Jesus and the temple all over. All right. Since you've waited this long, here's my favorite clips from Provo's Most Eligible. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our bachelor, Colin. I'm Sarah Bradshaw. I'm at BYU right now, and I'm studying. Ooh, Daddy Laika the Blazer. <laughs> All right, here's a real warning right now. Nobody is ready for the true awkwardness that is about to ensue in three, two, one. I'm good. What's your name? I'm Eva. Eva, I mm -hmm. love the hair. Thank you. <laughs> Modeling it. <laughs> yes. Here's next up, model who? <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'll well, see you. Where do I go? I you're, yeah, you're just going to go inside. <laughs> <laughs> so good. I've been super excited for this for like weeks now and like but unfortunately I did get trampled in a mosh pit last night. <laughs> it's now finally time to meet our host, Remington. Shannon. <laughs> the music. Ladies, this is the final rose. Colin, whenever you're ready. Sarah. The blazer? Why would he choose her? Oh, of course. So that's my take from episode one. I'll be watching episode two here shortly. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. And here's to all of us finding love like we know Colin is going to find.